Y'all wanna be the best like me But they ain't never spit it this fresh like me And they ain't never did it for the West like me But yet they y'all trying to be just like me What is up B team? It's your boy Curtis B here and I'm back with another reaction video. Before we start it, take one second to smash the like button. I would appreciate it so much. Five Finger Death Punch, the tragic truth official music video. Five Finger Death Punch is super dope, but you guys knew that, and that's why you're here with me to uh, watch me react to this song and official music video. Always gotta love that. Let's get into it. Death Punch. Against the wall. Against the wall, boys. And what's going on here? Oh, security bringing them out, huh? Or bringing them in. Is that a tattoo of a mohawk? Or is that a mohawk? I can't tell. It looks like a tattoo. Oh, okay, it is a tattoo. It's got some more designs to it, though. I thought it was just a mohawk, but it has some designs to it. That makes a little more sense. Oh my God, that looks intense. What the hell? He's hearing voices? Oh my God, he just downed that whole bottle? I guess so. Jeez, kids, don't try that at home. That's a good way to end up in the hospital. All right. Okay, as much as I love electric guitar, and trust me, I love it, sounds amazing. But man, every now and then, you just want to hear a beautiful acoustic guitar. Am I right, people? There's nothing like it. And then we get a mixture. I'm drowning in the bottom of a bottle. Running from a man I swore I'd never be Ooh. No one ever has to face tomorrow But I'm the one that has to face me It's the demons I created for myself Oh man I instantly love this song because I can relate to this I actually kind of made my own song Similar to what he's saying here. I think there's a lot of people who can relate to that situation Which always makes for a really good song I'm the one that has to face me It's the demons i created for myself yep. tragic truth. You're your own worst enemy It's hard for me to understand myself So it has to be hard as hell for you Oh man. Okay, this one's really deep here. Talking about fighting himself, right? He created a a kind of person in himself that he doesn't like. Like I said, I've been there. I think a lot of people can relate to that, which is really awesome. You literally are your own worst enemy. You have control of your own life, and there are things that surround you that can deter you away from your goals or turn you into something that you didn't want to be, but it's how you react to those you know, situations that surround you that makes you who you are. There's always a way to turn it around, though. You got to remember that. If you ever catch yourself in a situation like that, you can turn it around. I can't say the devil made me do it. I chose to be the one. 
what I am, the way I am today. I wish there was, but there's no way around it. In the end, I made the choice and will not die ashamed. It's the void. Okay. That hurts, but also at the same time, it is good to take responsibility for your own actions. So he's like, I wish I could blame it on something else, but I realize it's me that's doing this. It's my fault. I put myself in this situation. I'm the one who needs to fix it, essentially, right? So it is good to take responsibility for your own actions, and that's when you can probably start to turn it around once you realize that you have the power to do so. There was, but there's no way around it. In the end, I made the choice and will not die ashamed. It's the void. Fuck. Oh, shit. Might be a little too late. EMTs, come. EMTs. Here we go. Hey, can you hear me? Here we go. Here we go. Holy shit. That's scary. Okay, so it seems that this whole video was happening in his head, right? So at the beginning of the video, he downed that bottle, he passed out, he probably flatlined, and now this whole video, everything that's going on is what's happening in his head while he's laying there unconscious, possibly dying or even dead at this point. That's a really cool concept. Now he has all these demons inside his head that are getting to him, you know, eating at him. And meanwhile, these people are on the outside trying to save his life. It's so crazy. Oh man, sir, you know that's a scary situation. Okay, what'd you take, sir? Can you tell me what you took? Lay down. A whole Don't goddamn die, bottle of liquor? Don't tell the fans. Hold on, hold on. Is this about his real life right here? Is that what this is? These look like legitimate, you know, articles, like news articles. This is, this is dope. If that's what it is, sorry, I'm, I don't know much about this, um, this band in particular. I just know they make good music. I don't know his struggle with alcoholism or anything. If this is real or if it's just like a metaphor in his music video, but it looks real. Yesterday, I celebrated 42 months of sobriety. Oh, wow. That's awesome. And I can honestly say I will never... Hold on, hold on. I'll, I'm going to play that again, but I just wanted to shine a little bit of light on this part of him controlling these demons. That goes back to, you know, taking responsibility for yourself. You know, you're your own worst enemy. He knew he was creating these monsters inside him. He's controlling the demons the entire time. 42 months of sobriety. Nice. That's dope. And 
I can honestly say I will never let the darkness settle in ever again. Yeah. Wow. Oh, wow, that was so dope. I loved it, okay? The song itself was really good as, you know, just sonically sounding, or sonically speaking, I mean, sorry. Sonically speaking, it sounded good, everything about it. But the real story is the story of the song, the lyrics, the whole meaning behind it. Um, the video did a really great job of making like a mini movie out of what he was talking about. And the fact that that's like literally about his life that is amazing that is dope so good the whole time i was i was so enthralled by everything that was going on um man the meaning behind the song is just perfect especially now that i know that it's it's about his personal life that was great i hope you guys enjoyed my reaction to it if you did please just take one second to smash the like button um subscribe if you're new here i would appreciate it and leave a comment to let me know what else you want to see me react to i hope you guys enjoyed um this video man i'm <laughs> i'm i'm almost speechless at this point i'm just amazed at how good it was man that was so dope i hope i catch you guys here next time thanks for watching have a good one and peace out